strike, struck, stricken. Expand your vocabulary. American English in minutes, lesson number 19. Strike, many uses. Strike can be a noun. A transportation strike, shut down the bus system. Strike can be a verb. Don't strike a match in a dry outdoor area. The irregular past tense is struck. As a child, I first learned struck from a classic nursery rhyme. Hickory dickory dock, the mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one and down he run. Hickory dickory dock. And I realize now it should be and down he ran, but it wouldn't rhyme. I've noticed new versions have corrected this to the mouse ran down. That doesn't rhyme either, but the grammar is correct. Many strikes. A larger, older, traditional style clock strikes the hour. Something actually hits the bell to make it ring. A strike is a mark against someone. On YouTube, you must avoid a copyright strike. In baseball, a strike is when a player swings the bat but misses the ball. When workers go on strike, they refuse to work because of a dispute over something, such as poor working conditions or wages. As a verb, strike means to hit. We often hear about someone striking another person in an act of violence. A person or an animal can be struck by a car. Lightning strikes trees, buildings, and people. Do you know what strikes me? To strike someone has two meanings. Most literally, it means to hit someone. When we say it strikes me as adjective or noun, we mean this is the impression I get. She strikes me as an honest person. He left without saying a word. That strikes me as a strange thing to do. Remember, the past tense of strike is struck. I met him last week. He struck me as a rather quiet man. Suddenly, it struck me. If I say it struck me that, I mean I realized something or something occurred to me, came into my mind. I didn't think I could catch all of the words in an ESL video. Then it struck me. American English in Minutes has the full transcript on the screen. Sometimes I substitute, then it hit me. An idea occurred to you. You realize something. Strike it rich. If a person is mining for something valuable, that is, digging or drilling into the earth, that person might strike gold or strike oil. If a person suddenly gets rich, usually from finding gold or oil, we say he struck it rich. Stricken. In a legal proceeding, namely in a court of law, a lawyer might request that something be stricken from the record. This means crossed out. We also use stricken when talking about a disease. In the 1950s, thousands of American children were stricken with polio. People can be grief stricken. Grief is extreme emotional distress, usually due to the loss of a loved one. When the man died, his grief stricken widow was left on her own. Striking. You look striking. The well-dressed man cuts a striking figure. To cut a striking figure. To have an impressive appearance. There is a striking resemblance between the two brothers. Resemble, to look similar. Striking resemblance. Amazing similarity in appearance. The number of homeless people in Los Angeles is striking. Striking numbers are shocking. Can you hit a target from here? That is striking distance. This could be used by the military 
or just for personal goals. Strike up the band. To strike up is to begin. You might hear, strike up a conversation. Strike up the band. Start the live music performance. Strike can mean to reach an agreement. After a lot of bargaining, we struck a deal. Management were able to strike an agreement with the workers. In baseball, if you swing the bat at the ball and miss three times, you strike out. Men often use this phrase, I struck out. If they try to ask a woman for a date, but she refuses. Americans use quite a few terms from baseball in everyday conversation. Thank you as always. I hope you were awestruck by all the uses of strike. Awe, wonder, amazement. Awestruck. The person's reaction is wow. I hope you will continue to watch my channel, American English in Minutes. See you soon.